a very good morning to all. Welcome to the webinar on effective backup solution for VMware backup and replication driven data centers. My name is Manoj and I am a part of sales engineering with BMB Technologies. I will be hosting today's session. I see the attendees are quickly trying to join the session. So let's leave a minute uh, for everyone to get joined and then we can go ahead and get started. Thank you. Hope uh, all attendees have joined the session so we can um, go ahead and get started. To start with, let's have a quick intro on the company profile. BMW Technologies is founded in the year 2004. We are a private company profitable since 2006. We have 4,000 plus channel partners and we reached more than 60,000 businesses so far. We are headquartered in Chennai, India. 70% of our customers are from North America, 20% from Europe, and the rest 10% from Asia Pacific region. Bamboo BDR Suite is actually a one-stop solution for all your backup and disaster recovery needs, categorizing every requirement of small and medium-sized businesses. It has a group of products bundled together and they are Bamboo VM Backup for the backup and replication of VMware and Hyper-V, Bamboo Image Backup which performs a backup and biometric recovery for physical Windows servers and desktops, Bamboo Network Backup that helps you do granular file folder level backups and effective backup of applications like Microsoft Exchange, SQL, SharePoint, Active Directory, Outlook, MySQL, etc. And Bamboo Online Backup is purely a cloud-based solution where you can do file folder and application level backup directly to our cloud, Bamboo Cloud and Bamboo SaaS Backups Health is a backup solution for SaaS applications like Office 365 and Google Apps. Adding to that, we do have some add-on products and they are Bamboo Offsite DR. It's an add-on service which helps you to have a redundant copy of the data on a remote data center that could be a private cloud or a remote storage, SAN, NAS or whatever. And Bamboo Cloud DR helps you to set up a hybrid cloud environment where you can replicate the additional backup copy to our cloud, Bamboo Cloud, so that in case of a disaster, you can directly perform a disaster recovery from Bamboo's cloud. Bamboo BDR 360 is a manageability tool helps you to do a 24 bar 7 monitoring and manageability of uh, your applications where uh, you can if you have multiple BDR servers with one single pane uh, panel uh, you can just go ahead and monitor uh, all your backup servers with this BDR 360 console. And Bamboo Universal Explorer is an agentless software which helps you to do a restore of a granular restore of applications like Exchange. SQL, SharePoint, Active Directory instantly. Maybe this tool do a granular recovery from the image and the virtual machine level backups. Let's say if it is an exchange, you can even narrow down to a single mail level restore with this utility from the image level backups. Why we need Bamboo VM backup? So to answer this, uh, backing up virtual uh, environments are typically more expensive and difficult to manage nowadays. It actually requires a fundamentally different approach. So Bamboo VM Backup is exclusively designed for virtual environments like VMware vSphere and Microsoft Hyper-V by the experts in the industry. It actually fills the purpose here with the best breeding technology providing a manageable solution in an affordable cost for VMware vSphere and Microsoft Hyper-V virtual machines. Along, it not only backs up the regular virtual machines, it also ensures that it is backing up the applications residing inside the virtual machines are intact so that you can even perform uh, application level recovery and optionally it also provides uh, uh, a feasibility to do a cloud disaster recovery. So to get deep into the backup and disaster recovery part, we need an understanding of what is our PO and our TPO. Recovery time objective is like uh, how much time you take to recover a machine after a disaster and we are glad to say that with Bamboo VM Backup you can achieve an RTO of less than 15 minutes. There are various levels of recovery for virtual machines and important methods are instant virtual machine recovery and uh, where you can immediately spin the backed up virtual machine, uh, backed up VM in the, in the backup service hypervisor. Instant file level recovery where you can, you can instantly do a granular file folder level restore. Uh, you can do uh, immediate fail back or failover and uh, you can also do an application level recovery instantly using our Wimbo Universal Explorer. And RPO is like up to which point you can uh, recover a, a backup a virtual machine after a disaster. Bamboo offers a near continuous data production because it has an automated backup and replication scheduling and the backup frequency starts from every 15 minutes. So you can even achieve an RPO of less than 15 minutes with Bamboo VM backup. 
At any point of time, the backup data should be recoverable. If not, the backups are worthless. We have seen several scenarios where the administrators, while performing a DR, they'll come to realize that the backed up data is corrupted and eventually they end up in data loss. To avoid such scenarios, we have integrated an intelligent mechanism with Bamboo VDR where an automated backup verification runs post completion of every backup schedule or once in a day. So during this, ba during this process, all the backed up virtual machines are booted up in the backend and the screenshot of the boot screen will be captured and those screenshots will be mailed to the administrators. As an admin, you can simply take a look at these email reports which has a screenshot of the backed up virtual machines. Uh, if the screenshot shows uh, it's booted up successfully, you can simply rest assured that all the backed up virtual machines are bootable, uh, intact and ready to go at any point of time. So we do have a efficient storage management uh, method integrated in Bamboo VDR where we have integrated, we have uh, implemented our own file system called Bamboo Five, which is which is designed to efficiently manage the storage repositories of uh, of uh, media servers. Bamboo Hive is an efficient cloud file, cloud based file system designed for the large scale backup and disaster recovery applications with a host of advanced use cases. And this uh, uh, Hive file system can easily be implemented in any type of storage that could be a SAN or NAS or even a directly attached storage. And uh, you can automatically scale up or scale out storage devices with Bamboo Hive. It has an inbuilt version control, error correction, compression, deduplication, and encryption mechanism integrated in it. And uh, there are several needs from customers where they want to perform an instant migration between physical to virtual, virtual to physical, or uh, between hybrid virtual environments like VMware to Hyper-V or vice versa. So Vembu has a solution inbuilt with uh, Vembu is a built Vembu is a solution which has inbuilt migration planned for the backup virtual machines. It supports instant creation of VMDK, VHD, and RAW files of the backed up virtual or physical machine so that uh, the user can instantly start migration between P2V or V2V or V2P just by choosing the type of file which you want to put it on the specific environment. So this is the architecture of Vembu BDR suite where the important software component is a Vembu BDR server, backup server where you actually have the storage connected. Vembu VM Backup is an agent, uh, I mean, it's an integration service as a proxy that communicates with the VMware servers. These backups are purely agentless. When you directly add the VDR uh, uh, ESXi server credentials, uh, this VM Backup proxy will communicate with this VMware server, reads the information, sends it to the Vembu VDR Backup server. And from the Vembu VDR Backup server, optionally, you have an option to replicate to a remote data center using offsite DR. Alternatively, you also have an option to replicate the data to our cloud, Vembu Cloud, using Cloud DR, and both of them are optional. And uh, Vembu Portal is where you manage all your licenses, invoices, billing information, and uh, uh, the license required for Vembu Media Server will automatically be supplied from your Vembu Portal account. So, to take a look at the important features with VMware Backup and Replication uh, with Vembu VM Backup are Backup of multiple VMs in a single backup job or an option to create multiple backup jobs with a group of VMs is available. Uh, it supports VMware ESXi host and vCenter servers and uh, VM backup supports ESXi version 4.0 and above. It do supports vCenter server version 4.1 and above. IP and network remapping support for replicated virtual machines is also available with Bamboo VM backup. So to tape it, take a deep look of the Vembu VM backup, this is how the backups will happen on the VMware environments, where from the Vembu BDR backup server standalone protector console, you can call it as agentless because there is no need of manually installing an agent inside this VMware server. So from the Vembu BDR backup server console itself, you can directly add the ESXi server credentials so that the Vembu VM backup proxy, once after added, it will communicate with this VMware server it will read the information about the virtual machines there, encrypts, compress, only the encrypted compressed data will be sent to the Vembu BDR backup server. And again, in the BDR server, the received data will be deduped and uh, uh, it's stored in with Vembu Hive file system on the BDR backup server storage. And for VMware backup, the Vembu VM backup client agent can transfer various different types of transport modes. 
So depending upon the type of agent installation and the VMware environment, the VM backup client automatically choose one of the following transport modes. Or also, uh, you can also have an option to configure the VM backup client to use uh, any one of the specific transport mode permanently. You can just map it with one of the modes and the various modes available are direct sand mode, hot hat mode and network mode. The direct sand mode is the uh, agent, uh, the Vembu VM backup client agent will dare have direct access to the SAN where the virtual machines uh, are, uh, 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 virtual machine files are located. So it works both as a physical server FC and or a virtual machine ISQC. So the VM backup client directly reads the data which needs to be backed up from the SAN and sends them to the Vembu BDR backup servers as storage repository. So that's the direct SAN mode. And when it comes to hot hot mode, the Vembu VM backup client agent will be installed in any one of the Windows virtual machines uh, running inside that uh, specific ESXi server. So what happens is like the virtual disks of the VMs running inside the ESXi server will be attached to the respective VM where we have the VM backup agent. And from there, the VM backup client will read the attached disk and sends the backup data to the Vembu BDR backup server storage. So this is the hot add transport mode where uh, the uh, VM backup agent resides with one of the virtual machines inside the ESX server. And uh, the, the, the ultimate mode we have is like the network mode. It's a kind of legacy transport mode where um, the agent could be VM backup client agent can be installed inside a virtual machine or it could be a physical machine or anywhere within the network. And it uses the TCP IP connection uh, for reading the uh, information from the ESXi host and it will then send the data to the VMware VDR server. So the data transfer speed will be a little bit slower compared to the other two modes since it's a, a little bit legacy method of backing up the virtual machines from VMware to the VDR server. So this uh, covers high level overview of the product. So what I'm going to do is like I'm going to show you the live console of the Vembo BDR Suite uh, uh, 3.5 standalone product. How you can directly configure a backup and what are all the uh, various recovery modes uh, available with the uh, Vembo BDR Suite. So let me switch on to my uh, one of my test machines. So as you can see this is the Vembu BDR Suite's uh, uh, standalone uh, protector console where from one single console you can configure backup, uh, perform recovery, everything can be done from this one single console. Let's say if you want to configure a VMware backup, just click on backup VMware vSphere. So it will have an option to add a VMware server, it could be an ESXi server or vCenter. All you need to do is like just click on add VMware vSphere server and it will prompt you to enter that uh, uh, VMware vSphere credentials over here. So you need to enter the host name or the IP address of the ESXi server and the user access credentials and the port number to access it. And once when you click on save, the added ESXi server will be listed on the VMware backup configuration page. So if you want to back it up, I've just added, I've already added one from my test bed. So if I want to back up the VMs from this ESXi server, all I, can, I need to do is I just click on this backup now. So once I click on backup now, it there is a VMware integration service or a proxy or a VM backup uh, will go ahead and communicate with the ESXi server, reads and pop up all the virtual machines running inside that ESXi server. So I need to do select what are all the VMs I want to back up and proceed configuring the scheduling. This is where I can ensure the RPO of the backup, how frequently uh, you want to run the backup. So if you choose 15 minutes, you can even achieve an RPO or not of less than 15 minutes. So you just, you just need to select how frequently you want to run the backup and proceed configuring the retention. So retention is nothing but how many restore points you would like to have for the backup. So you can select uh, how many restore points here so that the retention cleanup will happen depending upon your retention policy. And again, as we said during the presentation, during the backup job, Vembo VM Backup not just backs up the virtual machine, it also ensures that the applications like Exchange SQL SharePoint running inside the virtual machines are backed up intact. This can be achieved by enabling this application aware process. So if I select enable this option, select require successful application processing. So during the backup job, it will actually check whether the applications running inside the machine is consistent or not. And it will run the backup only. It makes sure that the application is fine. 
so that you can even do an application level granular recovery with one single uh, image level or virtual machine level backup and uh, since these uh, applications are uh, uh, logs uh, trend, uh, application logs are sensitive you can even truncate the logs uh, after the uh, successful backup using this option so you can configure the retention over here all you need to do is just review the configuration provide a, a, a name for your backup job and hit run the backup it will immediately start running the backup as per the schedule so it's a very simple beside you can start backing up your virtual machines to your Bebo BDR backup server so when we speak about recovery options there are several recovery options available for VMware backups and some of the important recovery options are uh, the very first method is like uh, let's say if the backed up virtual machine is down on the source environment and it has critical applications running inside it uh, the very important uh, recovery method is the instant virtual machine recovery so if you use this method uh, it will go ahead and spin the backed up virtual machine uh, as a VM in the backup service hypervisor immediately so what happens is like you will get the VM turning on in a couple of minutes so you can directly attach it to your network so instead of the source VM you can use this VM as a spare VM and uh, uh, you can directly start using this VM uh, uh, for a spare VM until you rebuild the actual one on the production environment and let's say if you want to directly rebuild the VM on the source ESXi server you have a live recovery to ESXi server when you initiate this recovery it will directly go ahead and uh, 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 restore the VM data file to the ESXi server from there you can spin that virtual machine from the restored files and uh, if you need just specific files and folders uh, uh, from the backed up uh, virtual machine you can use this file level recovery what happens is like the backup image is directly mounted to the backup service disk, ma disk management so just like browsing into a, a local drive you can simply browse through the files and folders of the backed up image uh, from the backup server and copy what are all the files uh, and folders required for your clients and the disk level recovery is to do a selective disk level restore of your backed up images and the download option is like it's for performing a physical to virtual virtual to physical or instant uh, v2v migration where uh, you can download the same backed up images vhd vmdk vhdx uh, or flat vmdk and raw image file formats so uh, depending on the environment you want to boot you can select which file format you want to boot it up and directly start downloading the file so these are the uh, important recovery methods with VMware. So I hope there is a uh, 30 days of trial period available of uh, the product. So what I recommend is uh, you, know, you can directly download the product from our website, give it a try. I hope you will have an amazing experience uh, of a backup and disaster recovery when you directly give it a try with Vembu BDR Suite version 3.5. So uh, we are almost at the end of the session. Uh, what I would like to mention is like the session is recorded. So if anyone of uh, you are record needs a recorded copy of the session, feel free to send us an email to vembu-sales at vembu.com or vembu-support at vembu.com. You can directly uh, ring us at uh, the numbers mentioned on the screen. And um, uh, for any uh, queries or any questions or if you got any clarifications about the product, feel free to contact any anytime. We are available 24 by 7 to help you on this. Once again, thank you all for joining the session. Have a wonderful day.